Hi, welcome to Bailey Cabin. I'm Kristen. I am so glad that you have joined me to see what I got in my my Ipsy March 2020 bag. So this is the Ipsy 100th bag. So they sent everybody an extra item in each of their bags this month. Now I just got the standard bag this month, which is usually $12. I did sign up and pay for an entire year all at once when it was still $10. So getting all this for $10 is really a fun deal. I usually get the glam bag plus as well, um, but skipped out this month. Um, just, I've got so much stuff coming in. So this is the one I got this month. Um, I do like the teal and I actually like um, the, um, what would you call these? The detail on this. Not crazy about the inside, which we'll see in a minute, but um, certainly can be used for other things. The first thing we have is a Lexi brush, and I do have a few Lexi brushes and do like them. This is a little flimsy. Not sure. Maybe, I guess that would be a decent highlight blush if you, or a highlight brush, um, if you had something that was fairly pigmented and you don't have to put a lot of pressure on it, but it's nice and soft. And then we have the Kenzie perfume, which is so pretty. I already have perfume on, so I'm not going to spray it for you, but that is a nice size of perfume. Let's see if it gives us any details about the notes in it. Uh, the Luxie Beauty brush in Periwinkle. Um, would be full size and the MSRP on that is $24. So that is double what you would have paid for this bag straight out of the gate. Um, the Kinsey So Pretty Fragrance. Um, fruity notes of apple and tangerine, which are two of my favorites. Uh, fresh and bright wild green floral notes are the perfect mix of flirty and fun. So this is a deluxe sample and the full size version would be 100 mil. And this is 10 mil, so one tenth of that. So $55, so $5 and 50 cents um, for a nice size like that is really good. And then, this is the item that I picked this month. You get to pick one item from each um, level of bag that you subscribe to. So I got the Tatcha, the water cream. I have tried a few Tatcha things lately that I really, really like. So um, I have heard wonderful things about this and it feels, oh, it just is like putting nothing on your skin, but at the same time, it feels like it's just drinking it up. So I am really happy to have this. The full size, which would be 80 mil, is $88. And, oh, this is a pore perfecting. I didn't realize that, okay. Oily skin needs hydration too. It can become dull and even end up producing more oil. That has been my personal experience actually. So I have had oily to combination skin my whole life and I thought, sorry, the kitten's in the drive on. Um, 
So I was hesitant to put any oils, moisturizers, things like that on my skin, serums. And in the last year, I started using some serums and oils and my skin is less oily, even though I'm putting oil on it. So um, if you're a little bit hesitant to do that because you have oily skin, definitely make sure that you're hydrating because it's trying to make up for lack of hydration by producing those oils. So don't forget to hydrate even if you're oily, but so excited for this. Okay. Just talking away. <laughs> Next we have Ebony. It's a leave in conditioner, which I'm not seeing on here. That's weird. Hm. Satin Dream Leave In Cream with Caravis and Argan Oil. Detangles, smooths, and moisturizes for all hair types. That's good because I need a leave-in conditioner. I am running out of mine. Okay, then we have from Wander Beauty, a little magnetic cardboard case here. It's Costa Ray. And this would be a bronzer. Light brown powder has shimmer-free finish that can be used all over. This is a deluxe sample. The full, full size, which would be four grams, is $36. Let's see, this is 2.8 grams. So more than half of what the full size is. So, you know, 18-ish dollars for that. And then we have the Pacifica with Wild Hemp palette. And I noticed on the back of this, I've already peeked in here, that um, this is, they are based in Portland, Oregon, which is just, I, I basically grew up in Portland or right in the area of Portland. We are now across the bridge in Southwest Washington, but I thought that was really cool. It's kind of a local business and we have these 100% vegan and cruelty free wild hemp eyeshadows. Those are great everyday shadows. I don't even know why they put sponge applicators in here in any of these anymore. But look at that cute case too with the little tigers on it. Yes, those are hemp leaves. Hemp is good for your skin. You didn't see them on the box too. So these are very cute. And then we got this. Look at those cute little flamingos. This is the Shayna B. Miami highlight in guava glow. Can you see the little flamingos in there? That's so cute. Um, dab some on the center of your lids or inner eye corners for a three-dimensional effect. This is a deluxe sample. MRS, MSRP of the full size would be $29. So let's give that a little swatch. Those little flamingos are so cute. I hate to ruin them. Yeah, just a really nice, subtle glow. I like that. It's a little more pink when I look at it straight on than what I'm seeing in the camera, but um, I like that a lot. So happy to have that I am wondering if the leave-in conditioner came from something else because I've opened a few boxes and they may have gotten mixed up because uh, they're already listing the six items on here. So that's the extra item for the hundredth bag. 
so forgive me if I've included something. But here's what I'm saying. You've got your lime green interior, which is not my favorite, but you know, you kind of think of this as a bonus anyway, right? Okay, so what did you think of my March Ipsy glam bag, 100th bag? I'm happy with it. I think that um, for the $10 that I paid, $12 for what anybody else would have paid, that's a really good deal, especially for the Tatcha water cream. Um, that's a big... I have to rescue my makeup brush from the cat one second. Okay. She thought it was a toy. <laughs> anyway, and the brush alone um, paid for the bag also. So um, it's it's more than enough. Um, and the eyeshadow palette's really cute. Um, we'll take a look at that in another video. <laughs> I won't take the time to swatch it right now. Anyway, I hope you're doing well. I hope that you have landed on my video today because you are um, looking for a little entertainment and a pick me up today. This channel is always, and I want it to always be about positivity. So, um, comment below how you're doing. If you need some support, I am here for you and all of my subscribers. Um, mental health care is um, something near and dear to me. So if you um, need some support, just reach out, send me a message and um, I'll be happy to talk with you. I know it's rough times right now. So take care of yourself, take care of each other and I look forward to seeing you next time. Thank you so much for being here. See you next time.